here's that back there I was just talking to uh, on, no one straws I remember you too you kept putting drugs in my body and then you stuck a needle in my eye that's not how you make friends buddy that's... yeah listen to me listen to me I got a plan all right what's, what's gonna happen here is you're gonna give me some health and a flashlight and then you're gonna you know put yourself out of your misery or kill me Thanks, buddy. Much obliged. Now, when I first played this game, he did that, right? And I'm sitting here, I'm like, oh, God, I just died. No. So I'm sitting here, I'm like, I just died. But it didn't prompt me to do anything. And then, you know, he pulls up, yank, and, oh, I free. Ooh. You sure know? You're not going to, like, okay, press... X. That was that. That's that button, right? Okay. And uh, do a quick refill. Flashlight, first uh, quote unquote weapon. And I thought I had a lot of blood on me. Well, at least you know that's yours. I don't know whose blood I got on me. what you did, I'm going to stomp your head off. <laughs> Whee! Alright. Now we're going to be contacted by uh, Dana again. We're going to argue a little bit. Clark. Isaac Clark, is that you? Who are you? I'm no. Dana. I'm the one trying to rescue you. Why? What's going on? You're suffering from a unique form of dementia, Isaac. Something you contracted on the age of seven. How do you know? What are you trying to say? How do you know all this about? I'm diseased. Your dementia will kill you. Let's go to the hospital. Oh, in, I can treat you right. To Why should I trust you? We're in the hospital. Because I'm not the one shooting at you. with necromorphs. Fuck. Just follow the route I'm sending you. Oh no. So we have an objective now, don't we? Mission: Escape the hasp hospital. Jeez, it's happening again. The panic, the tear. It's the same on the Ishimura. I need to get out of this place. Follow Dana's route to safety. There are soldiers here, and they're trying to kill me. It's like they want to eliminate all evidence of this place, including me. Well, gee, Isaac, you know the guy did say terminate everyone. You know all key subjects. I'm pretty sure you're a key subject. at once. I don't think it was a necromorph. I think it was like a, um, ba -ba -ba, one of those things you put the mops in, you know, that the janitors have. His head go poof. Ah! That scared the crap out of me the first time. I, like, jumped out of my seat, right? Paused the game, jumped out of my seat, and I'm like, oh my god. Now, we're going to get um, three things of interest. Really, really big interest. First and foremost, well, not foremost actually, but it's important, is the Kinesis module, or TK module. Going off a slight acid drip. Correct me if I'm wrong, but there was a shadow on the floor. And I think it was Nicole. Post a comment. I don't know. Alright, our first little uh, access vent thingy. Interact with it and we go whoop. Go for a little crawl here. Turn around and it's a necromorph! But we don't have to fight him. Not yet. We will in about a minute. Or a minute and a half. Or less than a minute. We're gonna fall through that vent right there with the little lights coming out of it. Whoop. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Isaac, what happened? Are you alright? Should you be doing that? Why are you helping me? If Tideman finds you, more people will die. Including me. Not if you follow my route. I don't like this. You don't have to like it. Just hurry before you get locked in. 
evacuation in progress. Alright, so we need to go this way. But, there's glass. And we can't break it. So, interact with this little thingy here. Deactivate. Okay. And Isaac does his little engineering thing and fiddles around there and pulls out. Wait for it. TK module. Yoink. Pew. Aim and press circle to grab loose objects. These things. And I'm not going to launch that. There are, I believe, five spears in here. Two. Three. Four. Body. Okay, there's six. Alright, just take them out. Take them all out in case you miss. There's going to be two necromorphs that spawn. First one I'm going to get right there. Second one I like to pin up against that wall. So... You, sir, have a job, okay? You're the bait. And here's our first official encounter with the game's enemy. Stick him up. He's gonna hang there for a little while and stick this guy up. Okay, that's it. Now, different in uh, Dead Space 2. You have to dismember the bodies to get your pickups. Okay, it's kind of annoying because in uh, certain rooms, oh, we'll take that right away. In certain rooms, you know, when they spawn like six plus necromorphs, the bodies start disappearing before you can get, excuse me, before you can get the, their pickups. So, it's kind of a nuisance, honestly. Next, don't go rushing out here. Sneak up, aim over here, and pick up one of these, because there's only two spikes over here, but there's three necromorphs. You could also keep those two spikes and use one of the claws of the necromorphs. He has to be dead. See how I just uh, grabbed the, ripped the claw off of him? Stick that guy. Oops. Alright, so we'll just use this. And stick that guy. That's it. Credits, that's the game's currency. Those will become useful once we start hitting up stores. And everybody's right here. Ooh, and I'm just health pack. I'm gonna keep that. Because my health is in the green. Some more credits here. This is where we were. See? Those are there, the uh, little spikes that I pulled out. And run over here. There's some more pickups right here. More credits. Now, coming up next, we're going to be getting the plasma cutter, our first real weapon. Right? It's got two firing modes. You can either have it horizontal or vertical. Right? I'll be with you in one minute. Per piacere. Another health pack. Ah. Plasma energy. That would be the ammunition that the plasma cutter uses. Okay, you can't kill this guy unless you shoot him. And we can't do that as of yet because we don't have the plasma cutter. everywhere. If only we're like this in the hardcore mode, right? They left. Should have done the same. No. Not with that mouth. You. You. Thank God. Please come help me. Do I have to? I mean, like, you know, it's a survival horror game. You know, it's every man for himself. You shouldn't have been, uh, having, uh, having surgery right now. Oh, okay. You know what? Am I a doctor? No. But you know what? I'm still gonna try anyway. I'm gonna fix you right up. I'm gonna make you better than ever. And, uh, just wait for a minute while I fiddle around with this. Keep him busy, please. Aw, oh, 
Aw, you guys are getting along so- Oh. They were getting along so good. Alright. So we got ourselves a weapon. Chop off his arm. Take the claw. Stick him up. Take his second claw. Because we're going to get a second morph here. Uh-oh, I missed. Alright, normally what I do is I take the second claw off this guy and start beating him with me. You know, so I save a little bit of ammo, but that didn't work out. 